Alright, here's an example of finding an exact value, and you're going to want your unit circle with you. Um, so this says the sine of pi over 3 squared plus the cosine of 3 pi over 2. What is its exact value? So you just start by substituting in things that you know, and recall that this really means the sine of pi over 3 squared. That's what that really means there. Plus cosine of Okay, so the sine of pi over 3 is square root of 3 over 2, and I want to square that. And then I want to add the cosine of 3 pi over 2, which is 0. So let's square out this first term. Square root of 3 squared becomes 3, and uh, 2 squared becomes 4, and of course adding 0 to that becomes 3 over 4. And so the exact value of that is over 4. Let's do a uh, another example. Um, this is nice and quick here. So example, we want to find, uh, we want to use our calculator to find the cosine of pi over 7. Alright, so let me bring up my calculator here a minute. So the first thing that you're going to want to do when you use your calculator is you want to press your mode button. And then you want to go down here and make sure your your mode is in radians. It's a third line down where it says radians. If yours is in degrees, um, then make sure and put it over to radians and press enter. So let's quit that screen. Now we wanted the cosine of pi over 7. So your cosine button is kind of right here in the middle. And notice when you press that you automatically get parentheses. And so now uh, my pi is over here, uh, second caret key, there's my pi, divide 7, and I want to make sure and close my parentheses, and then press enter. And I get 0 0.90, but I want it to four decimal places, so I'm going to round that off to 0 0.9010. Okay. So that's the end of this first video on finding exact values.